everyone. I have some lovely indoor guests today that scared me, quite frankly, earlier, and I've captured them. And they're going to be going outside, which is why we're doing this before the official launch, because they just they need to go back where they belong. So, I have two lovely spiders that disturbed my shower this morning, and we're going to start with this little guy. And he's actually pretty cool. Normally I do not like spiders, but this guy has these lovely long front legs. Hopefully you can see them there. And he uses those. I He was sensing with them. He would tap around and then he'd go in a, whichever direction apparently they felt best. You can see he's a nice orangey yellowish color. His back end is a little more yellowy than his front. And you can kind of see he's got spinnerets on the back there, and then his little mandibles on the front. And I actually, I like him. One, because he's tiny. Two, because he's actually pretty calm. He's been sitting like that for a while, and it's going to make getting him outside a little difficult. But it's nice every once in a while just to be nice to spiders, I think. I've been trying to be better myself, just because we've got... A lovely spider here who will eat mosquitoes and gnats and maybe roly polies. Those are probably a little big for this guy, though. And he's just chilling, so he's gonna go outside. And I think he's really cool. Most of the time, I don't like spiders. So I'm gonna flip him back over. And we're gonna go for our other uninvited guest who, frankly, scares me a little bit more because he is a hunting spider. And let me rotate him actually this way a little bit because that's where his eyeballs are. So hopefully you can see him there. Now, he's a little more active. I'm going to lift him up. And if he runs for it, he's going right back in there as fast as possible. So, just kind of try not to scare him. Oh, 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 oh. Don't breathe on him. I He doesn't like that. But you can see he's got little black tips on his feet. You can see his eyeballs here. They're actually kind of cute. And that's something that I don't like saying about this spider because he's kind of iffy. And if you look back here, you can also see his spinnerets. And he is a lovely opaque color. I have never seen this spider before either. And he's definitely a hunting spider. When he unfolds, he can really book it. And he'll, what he'll do, instead of sitting in a web, is he'll just be crawling around until he finds his food. He'll go ahead and just attack it, instead of sitting in the web waiting for it like most spiders do. So, oh, he, don't, don't do it. So we're actually going to put him right back in until he's ready to go outside. Just, he makes me a little bit nervous when he starts twitching he'll take off. So, hopefully today you learn a little bit more about spiders. I'm not going to tell you to go save your spiders. Honestly, if a year ago somebody told me save spiders, I'd be like, oh no, 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 no. Those, those little boogers are trouble and I don't like them. But they're real good for us. They eat lots of things that we don't like that potentially carry disease. So, and these two are actually kind of cool. I've never seen these two species before. So if you know what species of spider they are, please tell me. Because I don't actually know. But I, I think they're interesting. I don't like them. I don't want them in my house. But they're interesting. And they're cool. And they deserve to live. So I'm going to put them outside. And hopefully you might consider that as well. But the actual official launch video is coming out soon. I'll have that as soon as I get my nice camera in, and hopefully you learn a little bit about spiders. So, bye!